Now then my friends, a very, very good day to you. It is early morning here in Ulverston, uh, birthplace of um, Stan Laurel actually. Remember him? Great comedy duo, Laurel and Hardy. Uh, anyway, behind me here, I've got a supermarket called Booths, which is pretty much like a, a Morrison's, but it's on a lesser scale. Um, I think they start, I'm, I've only seen them in the north. If you've seen them anywhere else, let me know. I think they start at around about Skipton, but there are lots of them up here in the Lake District. In fact, this was my mum's local. The last time that I went in this one uh, was with my mother about uh, three or four years ago. However, I found out that they do a full English breakfast right here in Booths, and it is supposed to be top notch. Now Booths isn't the cheapest of supermarkets so my mum used to say she went they're a bit expensive but you know you know you get what you pay for uh, she used to say that was more of a Leeds accent than a uh, she was Lancashire. Anyway we're going to go in we're going to try the big breakfast at this uh, little supermarket because it's, uh, it's not like a big chain or anything there I think it's uh, it's pretty small but hopefully the breakfast is big and hopefully it's good and we're going to mark it out of 10 and I want you guys to mark it out of 10 as well on looks alone hopefully it's going to be good because as I say when my mum was in the lakes this was her favourite supermarket she used to come here all the time and she said it was quality so please booths don't let me down. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click that little bell for notifications of when I upload new videos. Now, without further ado, my friends, let's go. Okay, so here we go, we're going to take a look at the menu. We've got a nice view out the window there of the, uh, I think it's a lighthouse or a monument anyway. So uh, anyway, take a close look at the menu. Right, well I think we're going to go for the uh, the Booth's Big Breakfast, which is £7, which is two uh, bacon rashers, we've got two sausages, two fried eggs, uh, half a tomato, flat mushroom, two hash browns, black pudding, Ooh, uh, okay, beans and toast, and then we'll have a latte as well. So uh, looking forward to this. Don't forget, we're going to mark this out of 10, and I want you guys in the comment section down below to mark it out of 10 as well. So come on, let's get this ordered. Right, okay, so I've ordered the breakfast. Interestingly enough, um, I can't have the big breakfast, I can only have the regular breakfast or the small English breakfast because they've got staffing issues due to COVID. So they've said um, basically it gives them a bit more of a chance uh, if they don't do all the large breakfast. I says, well, it saves me a few pounds anyway. Uh, so we're gonna go, it's the same breakfast, it's just on a smaller scale. Uh, that with a regular latte, actually it's charged me for two lattes there. Uh, I must uh, go and get that back. Right, let's take a look at this. Come to 934 one regular latte one large latte right okay i'll have to take that back and uh, have, a, have a look at the receipt right okay anyway i've been back to see him he's credited my uh, small latte back so i should have a large latte which he's going to bring over to me shortly so uh, looking forward to this got all the sauces here got the hp uh, and the tomato ketchup uh, which is high so that's good We've got a nice little view and a lovely day, so uh, looking forward to this. Right, okay, so my uh, latte's arrived, or is it latte? Latte? Who knows? Comments down below. Anyway, let's uh, taste this. It's good coffee, it's very good. Right, OK, 
Okay, so we've got the breakfast here. Uh, first impressions are, well, I mean, take a closer look at yourself first. issue is when they put toast on the plate it's basically a bit of a filler isn't it because if we take this toast off I'll put that there for a start uh, okay then we've got the beans we'll take the butter off as well because that's not really part of your breakfast is it um then this is what we're actually left with Right, anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to tuck in, we're going to try the sausage, the bacon, the egg, we're going to try each one of the items and uh, see what they like. So uh, let's, uh, let's tuck in. Right, first things first, let's get some HP sauce on. Uh, okay, now I'm tearing where it says tear. These drive me nuts, I can't stand them now, but this is going to go all over me. There we go. I mean, come on, get rid of the packets and let's go back to bottles. Uh, there we go. Right, now that's a complete mess there, isn't it? Right, I'll pop that over here. Right, and we'll tuck in first and we'll go in for the sausage first off. Pretty straight sausage there. There we go. I'll reserve. I'll reserve judgment on that one. Okay, beans. Here we go. Hmm. Trying to figure out whether they're Heinz or not. Okay, then we've got the uh, the tomato. There we go. Let's try that. Personally, I prefer tin tomatoes. What's your choice? Comments down below. Okay, right, the bacon. Bit of fat on there, I have to say. watery in the mushroom as well. Right. Sure about that one. Uh, we're going for the egg. Ooh, egg's a bit snotty. Taste that. Right, um, I'll try a little bit of the mushroom. Right, okay. Um, hmm. I'm going to come back to you in a minute, literally, in a minute. say is um, he saved me from having the uh, the big breakfast because it would have just been well <sighs> I'm sorry but that is not gonna be up there it's not one of the uh, best breakfasts I've had I've got to say in fact well uh, I'll drink my coffee that's quite nice actually I really do like the coffee um, we'll score this outside so I'll see you guys outside Right, okay, where do I start? I mean, sorry mum, but 
it was probably better back in the day because I've got to tell you that breakfast was not good. I mean, what was it, four pound something, four pound 20, four pound 30, I don't know, for, for a small breakfast. But really, what are you actually getting? You're getting a piece of toast, which they always put on, it annoys me, they put it on, they've started to put it on the plate to fill the plate up to make it look like there's more on there. Put it on the side, when I took that off, hardly anything on there. You've got one watery mushroom, you've got a few beans, because there was a, a tiny little pot of beans, and when you saw me pour them out, there's hardly any beans there. One sausage, a little bit of uh, bacon amongst the fat, uh, and a snotty egg. I'm sorry, but not good at all. And you should expect more from supermarkets as well, because these supermarkets have got the produce to give you to cook in their kitchens. All I can say is I'm glad that I didn't have the, the big breakfast because it would have been just more of the same and uh, not great at all. Uh, if I mark that out of 10, I'm going to go... I mean, God, blimey. Sorry, Mum. Um, I'm going to go... 3.6 uh, the coffee was nice not good at all sorry uh, that's boo the supermarket um, I don't know whether there was having an off day but I think at the moment uh, this is what I'm saying post lockdown I don't know what's happened to places it's just got worse and worse I did a Morrison's breakfast and that was terrible and it used to be really really good these places have really gone downhill uh, post lockdown. I have to say, smaller venues and smaller places and family businesses that I've been to are actually doing better. But we've got to make a stance uh, and not accept this uh, garbage. It, I mean, we, we work hard for our money and we're going to pay for rubbish like that. No, sorry, not good at all. That's Booth Supermarket. On the bright side, it's a lovely day. Ulverston is a lovely place. I'm in the Lake District and the sun is shining. That's all from me today. Don't forget to like, subscribe and click that little bell for notifications of when I upload new videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Right, starving.